the go to for the how to, you know that you want to get beautiful. Hi, Frumpers. I am back in the beauty cupboard and back in the land of fun new products. So I can essentially do a really cool new five things, which is very exciting. Um, so this week I've got a really exciting mix of things. And coming in at number five, I have the new Face of Australia Mineral Therapy Illuminator. Now they come in all different colors, but here are two fun shades. Now these things are pretty amazing because they pretty much have five uses and um, anyone who kind of has been coming to Primped for a while will know that I love illuminators and dewy skin. Um, so I always get so excited when I see a new illuminator on the market. Now this one, because there's different colors, there's dark ones as well, you can use them for all different kinds of things. So obviously as an illuminator you can use them to highlight the high points of your face. So apply a little bit here uh, on along your cheekbones even on the kind of bow of your mouth that's kind of traditionally where you apply your highlighter so you can use it like a normal highlighter but you can also use it to highlight your body so if you get like a nice light color like this you can put it on your cheekbones a little bit or even down the middle um, to give you a bit of cleave or whatever if you're wearing a low cut top you can mix it with your foundation as well. Um, so this is light enough and not too shimmery to mix with your foundation. So if you're finding that, you know, you have your favorite foundation, but it's probably a little bit on, more on the matte side, mix just a tiny bit of this in with your foundation and then apply it. And you just, the whole face is going to be glowy and radiant and just amazing. Um, so how many is that? Oh, you can also use it as a blush. So there's a pinky shade here. This one's called um, Angel Blush. And it's a little bit of a pink tinge to it so you can even apply it as like a really beautiful dewy cream blush um, that's going to highlight as well and you can also use it as a tan so there is a darker one somewhere and it's like a nice um, bronzy color so you could just apply that kind of you know if you're wearing something a bit sheer and uh, low card or whatever sleeveless you can just apply a little bit of it here or even on your legs and it's just temporary obviously um, but it will make you look all shimmery and glowy and tan for the night, which is awesome. So these are my pick for number five this week. Uh, I think they were my number one, actually. I'm getting confused. Let's go. This is my pick for number one this week. Um, and they're only $14.95, which is really, really good. So coming in at number two is the new Olay Complete Care Touch of Foundation. Um, it's SPF 15+. plus. Now, this is really exciting because... I love also a tinted moisturizer. It's so handy. You've got your moisturizer, SPF, and a little bit of coverage as well. It's so great for the weekend. Or it's great for anyone that doesn't like wearing too much makeup or you don't like the feel of foundation, but you still want a little bit of coverage. So if that sounds like you, something like this, right up your alley. So basically what this is, is it's the Olay uh, moisturizer. There's the packaging. The Olay moisturizer, but it's also mixed with the Max Factor foundation. So you're kind of getting a little bit of both here. You get a really light coverage. It goes on really easily. You can see the colors there. So it is, it's definitely got pigment to it. It's definitely colored, but it's much lighter than a foundation. So great for the weekend. Really awesome little product. I I'm a huge fan of tinted moisturizers and when it's something that's got great moisture in it as well as your sun protection and a great foundation like the Max Factor one, you really can't go wrong. So that's my pick for number two this week. Coming in at number three is the Yes to Carrots Age Refresh Brightening Facial Towelettes. Oh my gosh, such a huge fan of the Yes to Cucumbers Facial Towelettes, um, which were also brightening and glowy and but these ones are age refresh. The packet is really, you get so many in there. Um, they're a really reasonable price. And the best part is they stay moist because sometimes you find that you open the pack and then a few days later you go back or the next day, whatever, you go back for your next towel and they're all dry and scratchy. And I, I don't like that. And um, I'm pretty sure you don't either. Most women don't. So these ones stay nice and moist and wet in there, which is awesome. And they're also going to help your face brighten and listen anything that can get you more glowy go for it i say so this is a fun little thing they're not brand new but i've seen, i've been away and i've come back and i got really excited about them so thought i'd share with you guys um next coming in at number four is these really cool new um covergirl intense shadow blast shades now They've done these kind of things before, but what I love about these eyeshadows is that they're so easy to apply. So I've just been playing with it on my hand, on my eyes. This color here is the, 
what's it called? It's 800 is the shade. Um, but basically, as you can see, it's almost like a lip gloss um, applicator and you just sweep it on your eyes like this and it just sets dry. It's really amazing. So it won't smudge, it won't crease like a lot of the cream eyeshadows do. Um, this one, what sets this apart from the others is it's got a built-in primer as well, which means it's going to stay put even longer, which is awesome. And like I've just been playing with that on my hand and it literally, like it doesn't move. It does not move. It's pretty amazing. Um, they come in heaps of funky shades. What you can do as well, which I've been doing, is using this type of thing as your base for your eyeshadow. So you put this on first. Because um, it's got the primer as well, it doesn't stay, doesn't move around. Then you can apply a powder over the top. It'll just make your makeup last all day and not crease and go all weird. So huge fan of these. I think they're really, really clever. So easy to apply. Um, and a color like this, you, again, you can even use that as a highlighter and just apply it just under your brow bone there. Just to, It just gives you a bit more luminosity and makes you just look even better. So that's my pick for number four. And coming in at number five is this really funky new nail polish shade from Becca. There it is. I need to get a Manny. I'm not even wearing my wedding ring. I ran out of the house today forgetting everything. But um, so I love this shade. This is Tangerine Dream. Now, Pantone, who are the people in charge of all the colors, named this year's biggest shade to be Tangerine. Um, so you know that then it's going to start rolling out. We, we've been looking at these peach and apricot and tangerine shades um, for a couple of seasons now, and they just seem to not be going away, which is great for me. I love it. I actually have a color very similar to this on my toes, but I'm not going to like stick a foot in the camera. But Love this color, love Becca as the brand, really funky, fun, new nail polish. So I thought I'd share that with you guys as well. Anyway, Primpers, that is my five things for this week. It's good to be back. Good to be back doing five things. Um, tell me what you like, what you don't like, if there's anything you've bought uh, that deserves a mention. And I will see you all back on Primps next week. Bye. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yes, go to for the how-to, you know that you want to.